Welcome back. How are you, Aries? It's time for your reading. These readings are going to be ex-love, no contact. I haven't done one specifically for ex-love in over a month, Aries. Welcome back to Priestess and Medium Rosalind. Um, if you would like to get in touch with me for a personal private reading or you need um, help with root work uh, into some personal situations you may be having, uh, conjure candles, magic oils, things like that, you can find them below um, at rootsofearth.net or at uh, Priestess and Medium Rosalind, okay? Those are my websites. And I look forward to sharing my gifts and skills with you to give you some guidance, Aries. Let's look into <clears throat> X Love No Contact. It's August 2020. Let's get into this and see what's going on with your X Love and No Contact. Uh, since you've been, you know, not speaking, you want to know what's going on with this person, Aries, their thoughts, feelings, and energies around them. Mother, Father, God, Blessed Holy Spirit, please tell us what is around Aries' ex-love while they're not in contact. What's going on with Aries' ex-love, Mother, Father, God, Blessed Holy Spirit, while they've been in no contact? While they've been in no contact, what's going on with them? What's going on with Aries' ex-love? Okay, so Aries, it looks like this person is in heartbreak. Uh, this person may have also had interest in a third party. Uh, this person seems to be in heartbreak. They seem to be wounded. It feels like um, they learned some kind of lesson, Aries. Okay, it feels like they learned maybe they shouldn't have cut cords with you so quickly. Yeah, this person is actually, I feel like they're in a zone of depression I also feel that this person may be lurking and hanging around sometimes on your social media. Maybe this person knows where you live. Um, I'm hearing spiritually they were under some kind of contract with you, like a soul contract, kind of like a soulmate or a twin flame. There's a lot of heartbreak and this person actually wants to reunite with you. I'm hearing this is something about a reunion, something deeper. Um, <clears throat> I also feel there's a guide involved like a spirit guide involved that may help the two of you come back together uh, um, I'm also hearing that there needs to be more grace and understanding here the two of you need to know that both of you are in a cycle of healing there's a lot of things that may have happened um, yeah this person they still want to work together and be with you Aries uh, this is going to result in a lot of working together to make it back here to the twin flame, the two of cups energy, the soulmate energy. Um, this person is willing to work this out with you. Okay. But I think right now what's keeping the two of you apart and what they may be really feeling and drawn on, because we do have cords that connect us. Um, and some of those cords are way too active. The cord that I feel is connecting you to Aries is the drama drama, uh, not knowing how to express things mentally, not knowing how to express them verbally when you communicate with one another. I feel like this person does not understand fully how to communicate and show their feelings. Okay, so it leads to a lot of toxic things or it leads to them watching you and lurking, things like that. Yeah, <clears throat> this person, I feel like they are going to communicate with you. That's what really what I'm feeling and getting. They're going to communicate with you. I feel like this is a matter of the heart. Uh, this person needs to know how to control their emotions sometimes. Their thoughts and feelings are somehow intersecting with their emotions and they get confused, Aries. Okay, that's what I'm getting. That's what I'm getting. I feel like, yeah, I feel like this person is not in balance sometimes and when the two of you separated you're not speaking or having communication it made things worse and they feel like they're just you know a little bit hopeless they feel depressed i feel like they want some kind of promise delivery um or they will deliver on a promise that they had with you okay like they don't feel like this is over and the energy does not feel like it's over at all okay so Aries, that is your ex-love no contact reading for August. 
and I will talk to you all again soon. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.